right the head of Kamikaze, drops the Japanese star, and I mean he caught him and caught him solid with a steel chair as the bell now sounding. I don't know whether Tony Adu thrown out of the ring onto the floor. Mike Jackson in the ring, Mr. Kamikaze hit hard with a steel chair. The bell has rang, the referee ordering the match to be stopped. I do not know exactly what the decision is or will be, but this has been some sort of a match here. And Ledoux once again thrown through the ropes onto the floor as Mike Jackson trying to fight two men now. Jackson down, Kamikaze still staggered, and I mean staggered because he was hit and hit hard by a steel chair. Mike Jackson wanted the fight, throws a punch, receives a punch, staggered into the ropes. Both men tired after a tough, wild match. Ledoux once again thrown out of the ring. And I believe the official verdict of this match a draw because of the time running out. We'll be back with more exciting action after a brief pause. This match has been declared a draw. Gentlemen, we join this match in progress here in Nashville, Tennessee. Before a capacity crowd, the popular black star Rufus R. Jones going against Big Jim Lancaster. Lancaster weighs well over 300 pounds. Rufus Jones in command now with a series of barrages on the arm as Rufus Jones has the arm barred. Rufus R. Jones, a leading contender for the Southern Heavyweight title in action here in Nashville, Tennessee. Definitely in command, has Jim Lancaster down on the mat, has the arm barred very securely around the wrist and high on the shoulder with good leverage. As Rufus, in charge, has done a fantastic job so far throughout the whole match. Been definitely in command, showing why he is a leading contender for the crown held at this time by Jerry Lawler. A double chop to the Neck staggers Big Jim Lancaster. Rufus sends one into the midsection. Lancaster retaliates. Rufus right back with a short right-hand chop. Takes the big man, whips him across the ring, into the turnbuckle. And Lancaster on the ropes, staggered, all across the ring, into the turnbuckle once again. And a big man down to his knees. And Rufus continues punishment on Big Jim Lancaster. Shoots a right hand. Catches him in the neck area. Staggers Lancaster. Lancaster in trouble. A big left to the midsection. A right to the chin. And Rufus Jones definitely now in command as he has been throughout the whole match. Lancaster staggered in trouble down on his knees. And Rufus given the very popular Rufus strut. Winds up. Rears back. A big headbutt. Lancaster, what is holding him up? A big headbutt by Rufus R. Jones. Lancaster does not know where he's at. I believe he's out on his feet. A second headbutt drops him, and I mean drops him hard as Rufus does the strut, picks the big man up once again, sets him up. The third headbutt drops Lancaster down, one, two, three. And Rufus R. Jones, the winner here in Nashville, Tennessee, and still a leading contender for the crown, now held by Jerry Lawler. And we will be back with more wrestling action after a brief pause. Ladies and gentlemen, 
Settle in this is Sterling Brewer at Birmingham, Alabama, watching a championship match for the NWA Middle uh, Mid America Heavyweight Title. Don Kent, the title holder, is being challenged by former U.S. Heavyweight Champion Lou Fez. Lou Fez and Don Kent have been having at each other for several minutes now. This match is one fall. It carries a one-hour time limit. Lou Fez being whipped onto the rope comes back. He's got Kent down. Sir Clement coming in. The manager of uh, Don Kent to stop at the back of Lou Fez to give the advantage back to his men. Fez has said that he'll use this match as a stepping stone to try to regain the U.S. heavyweight title. But first, he's got to get this title away from Don Kent. He is perhaps the most experienced wrestler that Kent has had to defend the title against thus far. The advantage is swap places back and forth on several occasions. There's still a lot of time left in this match, and both of these men are in great condition. They can go in that ring for a long, long time. But I'll tell you, there's a lot of punishment being handed out in that ring right now. Lupez with a series of rapid blows and forearm smashes. Coming off of the ropes, trying to straddle Kent, but Kent was ready for him. He got the fist up, caught Fez right in the pit of the stomach and dropped him. Fez got up slowly. He's groggy on his feet. Kent moving in, pounding away. But Lou Fez coming back with a big right, drives Kent onto the ropes and into the corner. Lou Fez, former heavyweight champion, working on Don Kent, trying to take the Mid-America heavyweight title away from him right now. Look out, Sir Clement, reaching through the rope, tripped up Lou Fez. Fez goes down. Kent taking advantage of it, stopping him in the...